Emotions are high in Decatur tonight, less than 12 hours after a political website leaked what they claim is Aaliyah's report on the deadly force shooting of Steve Perkins, and it includes graphic body camera footage. I'm Dan Schaefer. And I'm Nikkel Williams. We've spent the day out in the community speaking with the Perkins family, members of them standing in a power group, as well as digging into how the footage could impact the murder case against a former Decatur police officer. We are bringing you continuing team coverage with the latest developments. Way 31 reporter Maddie McCaffrey and Way 31 weekend anchor Rob Sneed are indicator tonight following a protest outside City Hall. First of all, Rob, what are the protesters' demands? Well, right now, uh, those protesters are gone, Dan. About 40 of them were here about an hour ago, and they were marching. They said that they are glad that the video was uh, leaked, and they also say that they have right now more questions than they have answers. We actually, we want, we reviving, reviving the march, reviving the protest. Uh, it's not over. What does that mean for you? That means that justice has not been served. Yeah. Society has, be has to become compassionate for somebody, okay? Now, th uh, these protesters marched up 6th Avenue, fired up than ever before after seeing the leaked video. They feel the Perkins was not given enough time to comply. Now, Rodney Gordon, NAACP chapter president from Morgan County, told me that seeing that leaked video was disturbing. He says he has more questions like, uh, where is the body cam video that leading up to the police arriving at Perkins' home? He also says, why wasn't Mayor Tab Bowling, or why hasn't Mayor Tab Bowling and Police Chief Todd Pingan released a statement following that leak. A coward dies a thousand deaths. They running. They done took their tail. The dog done wagged his tail and he gone. That's right. I think we saw Steve Perkins come out of his house and not know that anyone was there. Right. They say they saw a gun. I didn't see a gun. Me neither. In complete honesty. They saw that, said they saw a gun. The only gun I saw was in the steel picture that was laying on the ground. Tonight I did reach out to Mayor Bowling and for comment and he sent me a state or actually didn't send me a statement. He sent me a text message back that said, quote, please submit your inquiries to Aaliyah. Of course, we'll stay on top of this and bring you the latest information as we get it for now. I'm reporting live at Decatur City Hall with coverage you can count on. Rob Sneed, Way 31 News.